Hey YouTube, I'm here at the Expo Center with the youngest gold wing rider in the world. Check him out. I want him to introduce himself to you right quick. Go ahead, my man. What's your name? Ryan. Ryan, what are you on? What, what, what bike are you riding? Hills. Hills. <laughs> Tell me, what type of bike is it? What type of bike is it? Gold wing. Gold wing. Do you love it? Yeah. Do you tell him, hey, wake up and take me for a ride? <laughs> no. <laughs> Why not, man? That's what he's supposed to do. Say, hey, wake up, let's go for a ride. Next time, next time you want to go for a ride, that's what you do, okay? All right. Now tell me, what do you like about the gold one? What do you like about it? It's big and comfortable. Man, he's a natural. He's a natural. He's a natural. Yes, sir. Thank you very much for for your interview. I want you to put your name out there one more time for me. Ryan. All right, Ryan. Hey, the youngest go wing rider. He's a Kelly Hinton rider, and I'm standing right here beside him. Say hey. Hi. <laughs> Thank you, my man. Hey, 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 hey. Hi YouTube, hey, this is your boy Tech Savvy. I'm here at the Expo Center. This is the last day, and I met this gentleman at, what, Wing D41? Wing D41. All right, yeah. and I asked him a simple question back then, and I'm gonna ask him that same question now. What, what first thing I'm gonna ask you is, how many Wing D's you been to? Two, this is okay, my second one. this is your second Wing D. Yes. Okay, now, tell me about what you got, what you ride. Yeah. Well, I ride a 2017, uh, GL 1800. Okay. Now, do you name it? Did you name it? Well, you know, ever since you asked me that question, <laughs> it has been plaguing me because I didn't have a name for the okay. bike. You know, okay. I had uh, I only had it, you know, maybe six, eight months before the wing ding. Okay. But anyway, I finally came up with a name for my bike. All right. So hit me up. What's the name of the bike? It is the Blue Dragon. All right. I just got to seeing some pictures, and I'm hoping that his pictures uh, can come through. Uh, uh, we're inside, so I don't, I won't be able to go actually show you his bike. But he brought some pictures just so I could show you, and his bike looked awesome. So I'm gonna ask him to pull out his phone and see if he can right. try to uh, post what his bike looked like, cause he just got a paint job done on it, and I'm gonna let him explain it while I hold the camera up so he can hold it up and tell y'all what it is. Okay, this is this is the Blue Dragon. And I see a light in it, so we we're trying to get the flare of the lights out. Okay. Now, as you can see, I'm trying my best to get the angles out of the. the let me let's turn around this way. Okay. Try to get this. Try, okay. Now, I'm okay. hoping you all can see this. Uh, there's so much glass around yeah. here. But this is the front of his, basically the the the, the lower level out under the windshield. It's a painted dragon head on the front, and in the nose cone, he's got lights in the nose cone. So it's making it look like the dragon painted on his front end, front of his bike, has eyes when he turned the lights on, and that is awesome. And, and the amazing, <clears throat> the amazing thing is, is when you walk around the bike, the eyes seem to follow you. Oh, man. You, you can't tell it here, but uh, but the eyes are are watching you. So if you ever hang around my bike and trying to do something you shouldn't, you know you've been watched. <laughs> <laughs> man, you gotta bring that. You got. You gotta bring that to Wing D Forty Three, man. So I'll be I, there. I, I want to see that myself. I'll, I'll, I'll be there. Hey, man. Yeah. And I just want to say, hey, thank you for letting me interview you again. Uh, yes, so, yes, yes. And I hope I see you at Wing D Forty Three. Well, listen, we can't make this an every two year thing, so. Let's because COVID stopped us last time, so yeah. we'll do it again there you go. next year. There you go. In Thank Louisiana. You. All right, man. <laughs> you have a good one. Oh, no, no, no. Um, hey, 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 hey. How you doing, uh, man? You know I got What's your up, camera. YouTube? I yeah, got your that's camera. That's all right. That's all right. <laughs> Where's Memphis Mike at? Where's he at? <laughs> man, we tried, we tried to get Memphis Mike out here, man, I but know. he said he, he wasn't won. doing so good. No, he wasn't doing so good, so hey. I, I called, I shouted him out, and I actually emailed, I mean, text him. Okay. He was wondering, because, uh, you know, a lot of people have his number, he didn't know how. Yeah, yeah, and, yeah. And I'm yeah, like, yeah. well, there's an app 
that I had, and I'm like, oh wow, that's that's his real name. But you know, I just <laughs> want him to know. <laughs> I I got one of the cattle hunters riders. Y'all know I just got to meeting Chris. I was at his uh, at his bike. I want you to tell me a little something about yourself. What do you ride? We already know you with the Chris Kelly Hinton group. Yeah, so, buddy. <laughs> right, so tell me a little bit about you. We all know about Chris, so tell me about you. Well, like, I'm riding a 2020. Okay. Going. Um, I'm retired. I'm coming out of PA, Pennsylvania. Okay. And pretty much, and my wife, also, this is my wife, by the way. And she, Hello. Also, <laughs> she okay. also rides a 2019 Road Smith. Oh man! Yeah. I, you know I got a question. Where's Black Flash at? It's over in the corner somewhere. I just I, I took off the trailer so uh, I can get over there. Hi, how are you? All right. Now my question for you, just, yes, sir. How many wing dings have you been to? Just this is my second one. This is your second Last one. Last year I wanted to meet you, but I couldn't. I was so fast. I was like, oh my god! Hey. Now that's why I had to yeah, stop. They don't call me Flash for no reason. That's right, yeah, man. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right. Now my next question for you yes, is. Sir. I uh, I know you you got your lovely wife with yes. you. Okay, I want you to tell me mm -hmm. since he got. Do you ride with him on his gold wing? On his gold wing previously. Oh, okay. Not, not on this one. Okay. Yet. Then I got a separate question for you. Now, yeah. how many wing things have both of y'all been to? This is our second one. Okay. Last year was canceled, so we couldn't come because it was right. canceled. What I'm up against right now, y'all probably already know the question. Yes. I, I've been told that Wingding is only for a bunch of old folks no, it ain't. who got who, who got money and don't want to do nothing but come out to Wingding and spend it on their motorcycle. Not true. So this is your second Wingding, so tell everybody how you feel about Wingding. Well, I love the atmosphere. I've come mostly for the people. Okay. Um, hotels are too pricey. But other than that, <laughs> you ain't lying. So it's, it's, true. it's true. No, I'm straight out. And but I mean, you know, I, I really think it's a really nice atmosphere. Good, good company, you know. And I, I mostly come for you guys, the bloggers. You know, um, meet new people, see new things. That's what I come for mostly. Hey, that's what I'm talking about, man. Yeah. And so it all comes all down the to the. The, the camaraderie and meeting your fellow riders, correct? Absolutely. All right. Now, I got a specific question for you, all right, because I don't get a chance to meet ladies like you, so I'm going to ask you this specific question. What made you decide to get your own ride? Say, forget the hubby. Right. I want my own ride. Um, I feel like when you're riding the motorcycle yourself, you're in control. As a rider, behind somebody you're just riding and just looking around and you see sceneries and everything yeah. but when you are riding yourself you're in control of that bike there and I go. like that so my next question for you for the next lady for the ladies that are thinking about getting their own bike oh, what do what advice can you tell them I advise the them classes. to first um, do the the um, online testing okay. that they have for your license so you can see all the questions that they have and what you have to do to be safe out there Pre I mean not even get a bike until you do all that um, you get all the safety tips and then take the class secondly the okay. writers class because they give you a lot of tips for safety okay. and I don't only use, utilize them for my bike. Now I find myself utilizing a lot of it when I'm in my car also. Oh, um, yeah. So, hey, not only are you learning a lot, you're learning for more than just that motorcycle. Oh, you're learning, yes. You're learning lessons for life. Oh, That's yes. Right. So, hey, I appreciate you sharing that knowledge with me. Yes, Thank you, sir, for hey, both of y'all coming out, man. Ready. And I, I yes. appreciate it. And a safe trip. I know y'all gonna probably oh, be leaving out today, right? What? Yeah, oh, Pennsylvania. Yeah. Oh man, hey, safe travels, man. Yeah. We do it all the time. <laughs> we rode from PA to Tennessee to meet Chris and then ride here. Hey, wow, that now, that's alone a, is a trip. That's a trip. That's a, you know, how much? How how many miles you think you actually put on just coming to here, here to get here? Over fifteen hundred. Wow. Oh, yeah. Wow. Couple days. I can't even remember the last time I did 1,500. It's a, a, a 1,010 to get to him and then 
Did y'all right. try to do the iron butt in it, or y'all just said? We never, you know? we never did that. We yeah. just, we, we don't do have nothing own. to prove. We just ride. Yeah. I, man, you know I love her, man. Yeah. I ain't got to prove. I ain't got to prove nothing to nobody. No. Just let me enjoy my ride. That's it. <laughs> there you go. That's hey, it. I That's appreciate. Lady Luck, I remember. <laughs> How you doing, I appreciate Lady y'all letting me get yes, you on camera, man. I watch your channel all the time. Hey, man. Thank all you. Thank you, man. And by, by the way, my deepest condolences. Oh man, hey, yeah, I appreciate it. I appreciate it. I saw that video. Yeah, and, and it just happened to her too. So, oh, yeah, yeah. Wow. In fact, well, that's well, what happened. I know. <laughs> 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 man, hey, y'all have a safe trip, man. Hey, all right, man. <laughs> Hi right, YouTube, hey this is your boy Tech Savvy. I'm here on the other side. We're getting ready to do the close. We're getting ready to do the closing for the ceremony and I just met another gentleman. I met him before. I want him to introduce himself to you right quick. So go ahead, sir. My name is Mike Gallahan. I'm from San Antonio, Texas. Tell everybody about what you own. Uh, 2001 Motor Trike. 2001 Motor Trike. Have your name. I haven't named it. I'm still looking at it. I'm kind of leaning toward Miss Red. Okay. Now, my next question is, how many wing things have you been to? This is three now. Okay. Now, what I'm up against right now, this is a question I've been asking everybody. Mm -hmm. From the, the stigma is, wing ding ain't nothing but a bunch of old folks getting together, spending money to go buy parts for their motorcycle. This is your third wing ding. What can you tell other people, or tell my viewers, what is wing ding actually all about for you? Well, I've been to wing dings where we went on the rides. And okay. I remember one time uh, we rode the tail of the dragon and had a great time. Okay. But you did it the next day and it was really challenging. Uh, a lot of people have ridden in, uh, ridden here in Branson. I had some bad luck, had a little trouble with my bike, so it's in the shop, getting repaired. Miss Red will be back red on the road again soon. Okay. And, uh, but for education, classes I found out a lot about uh, what I wanted to do with my bike a little bit later so it, it, might have to go to a might have to go to an 18 plus uh, trike oh so, yeah hey go well if, if I win here a little if I want to go <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. it go a long way towards <laughs> that <laughs> okay okay now my last question for you uh, did you enjoy yourself while you was here well, I've had a great time I okay. had a great time. Okay. And you get to connect with people. Ran into Chris earlier. Run into Carnell today. And see, you already answered my next question. It's all about trying to meet people. It's not about oh, coming bet. here to spend money. It's about coming here to meet Correct. people. And I appreciate you getting, letting my viewers know that. And I want to shake your hand on camera to say thank, thank you. you. And thank you for letting me get you on camera. Thank you. <laughs> all right, YouTube. Hey, this is a rare occasion for me. And I want to share it with you all. I'm here at Wing Dean on at the Expo Center and I came across a homeboy from Mississippi who's been watching my channel and he didn't even know I was from Mississippi. So <laughs> I want him to introduce himself to you and then I'm gonna ask him a couple of questions so y'all can get to know him. So first I want him to tell me, tell you all who he is, where he from, and what you're riding if you're riding. My name is Ronnie Harper. I am from Jackson, Mississippi. I have been following Cornell Luckett in the Black Flash for four entire years. <laughs> I have been trying to get here for four years and finally made it. I was so impressed about the Black Flash. So I said one day I will get a chance to meet him and today is that day. And it was so beautiful just to see it in person and talk to him for his character and personality. I just love it. All right, now, tell us what you own and what did you see last night at the light show? Cause well, I wasn't able to see it. Right. Even though I know, you know, I, I, I you know, I, I took it. I right, have, tell me what you saw out there. Okay, first of all, I have an 1800 Goldwing track 07 model. Okay. And from what I seen last night, it just, blew me out the water, which I have seen some stuff, but not to that level. And Black Flash really didn't have a real good competitor, and it just did what it normally do. <laughs> and I have heard this statement over and over, 
He said he is not stepping his game down. <laughs> if you want to, step yours up. I respect <laughs> that. That means you have to put the work in. That's what I see. <laughs> man, thank you, man. Thank man. you so much. Now, I want to ask you personally from, are you belonging to a chapter down there in Mississippi, or are you just a gold wing, a, a long wolf, a gold wing rider down there I in I just gold, like gold wings. I do not belongs to a chapter, no motorcycle club. I just love riding motorcycles. Okay. So, you know, I've been riding since nine years old, and the Gold Wing is my final last bike. So I decided to say, okay, well, this is time to see what the big boy is doing, and I have seen a lot. Okay. Yeah. Now, so this basically, is this your first wing thing? The very first one. Okay. Now, with this being your first wing thing, I just want to simply ask you, give me your input on what winding which from what what have you seen about winding that you can explain to everybody else because right now everybody's saying winding ain't nothing but a bunch of old folks getting together spending money so this is your first one you came out you saw it now you're here uh, you finally made it tell everybody what's your impression of winding from my personal experience this weekend for what they say winding is this winging that i don't go for that but at the same time, it's something you have to see for yourself. You can't believe what everybody tell you. And it's not a bunch of old people getting together spending money. These, what I have seen, they are living life, enjoying life. And if you are thinking about riding a motorcycle, get you a gold wing. That's what you get. <laughs> <laughs> My man, yep. you, you didn't share so simple. much knowledge with me, man. And, uh, and, and I'm going to be the first one to tell you, it's hard for me to meet people coming from, from back home. Uh, because we are, when I do meet you, it'll be in another state. So it's right. like I, I, I met a brother in another state. Right. And, and when, when you I when, when am, you said yeah. you were from man. Mississippi, and you, it, it surprised me when I told you I was from Mississippi. You didn't all, know that. Out of <laughs> I was all like, the videos I've been following, this man, I never <laughs> knew he was from Canton, Mississippi. Mississippi. I can spit that for. <laughs> I can walk there. <laughs> <laughs> and to make it all the way to Springfield, Missouri, I guess to meet him. This is a homeboy. It don't happen like that every day. It, it don't, man. It don't so, happen like that every so day. My input is, hey, get around. One, get you a bike. Get get a gold ring. Two, once you do, you're going to start coming across people that you are going to enjoy because now y'all have a common interest, which is that gold ring. And another thing I can say about Wing Ding is when you do come out here, you're going to see all the different techniques, all the different ideas that all other Gold Wing riders have for that bike. Am I right or wrong? The newest and the newest and the latest and the latest. And all over this greatly. And, and they're going to all give you some idea for you exactly. to have some idea on what you want to do to your bike. That's one of the reasons I came to see it firsthand, to see what's really going on. Stuff that I thought I knew, which I did not know, <laughs> but I know now. <laughs> I know now. <laughs> Uh, my brother, so I appreciate it, man finally getting a yes, chance to meet you. We talked last yes, night, so I'm going to go ahead and turn this off so we can get to know each other, yes, man. <laughs> All right, hey, I, I just want to say, hey, this is come probably going to be the final video for the day, uh, final interview, and I end it with my homeboy, man. Marty Hall. And I'm glad I finally got a chance to yeah, put you on man. camera, man, so, so appreciate I appreciate it. it. Man. It's a pleasure, it's a pleasure. <laughs> All right, now, GoPro, start recording. Hey, hey, hey.